In this video, we are going to demonstrate the prone knee bend test, also known as reverse lasag or femoral nerve test for radicular pain in the lower extremity. Get our very own assessment ebook and mobile app. Links are in the video description. Hi and welcome to PhysioTutors. The diagnosis of lumbar radicular syndrome is commonly made by patient history alone and additional testing to confirm this hypothesis is often not necessary. 90% of cases involve nerve roots L4, L5 or L5S1 as those segments are exposed to the highest static and kinetic forces. To make a diagnosis of lumbar disc herniation with root compression at those levels more likely, the crossed straight leg raise can be used as it tensions the sciatic nerve. While uncommon at around 5% of cases, lumbar disc herniations with nerve root compression occur at L3, L4 and to an even lesser degree at levels above. Suri et al. from 2011 investigated the diagnostic accuracy of the prone knee bend for lumbar disc herniation with nerve root compression at L2, L4 and found a sensitivity of 50% and a specificity of 100%. For nerve root L3 only, the sensitivity was 70% and specificity 88%, so it has a moderate clinical value to make the diagnosis more likely. To conduct the test, the patient lies in prone position. Then proceed to carefully flex the knee on the affected side maximally. If you are unable to flex the knee further than 90 degrees, or if you want to emphasize stretch on the femoral nerve even further, you may add passive hip extension. The test is considered positive in case the patient reports shooting pain down the leg or anterior thigh upon maximal knee flexion with or without added hip extension. Some authors recommend to hold the knee flexion for 45 to 60 seconds, though that may be too provocative in an active nerve root compression. All right. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, now's the time to do so. We hope you enjoyed the video and if you want to watch more, check the recommended video right next to me. For more information on our assessment products, check the links in the video description down below. And as always, this was Andreas for PhysioTutors. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.